Here we go. Happy Friday. Mind your brew. Happy Friday, don't Friday. Do, don't do me skirting it. Hello. Look at it. Hello. <laughs> the Wanderer returns. Back from <laughs> far flunk climbs. Yes. Mm. She's been away. That's I know. Been. And look what's happened while I've been away. I've been buying some yarn. I know. Oh dear. I came in, she says, oh, she says, go and set camera up and what have you. Yeah. And I thought, oh, look at that. You may have seen some of it before, so don't get too I know, excited. But, but I've not. You haven't seen it through Sue's eyes. Well, it's lovely, that. Yeah. Colours are gorgeous, though, aren't they? It's got wool in it, I think. Put your windows on. I will. Have a look. Fight right bit. It's ice. Yeah, you have seen it before, but there we go. Yeah, it's only 30% wool. Oh, and it's that chain construction as well. I love that. I know, that's why I ordered it. I like I know. chain. We like chain. We do. So, oh, lovely. And the blues, lovely. Yeah, the gorgeous. Gorgeous. There's three colours. Oh. There's that blue, there's that, and then there's that grey that's in the bag over there. Excuse me. Excuse you. Excuse us. Oh yes. Very nice. It goes from light almost to black, doesn't it? Really? It does. And that's sort of like quite a pale grey blue rather than just yeah. a grey, isn't it? Well, I think it actually says it's blue, but I see it as grey. But you know when I looked at it back on the video the other week, yeah. it, it did look blue. Let me see what it says. Yeah, this pale blue here is, yeah, light yeah, blue. Yeah, it says light blue, navy, navy light, light blue. blue. I mean, I do see the blue in this one. Oh, it's a lovely feel to it. I do see the blue in that one. Oh, yeah, that's got an almost purpley sheen to that dark, yeah, the dark. that bit. I do see blue. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, guess who we've got with us today? Look who's here. A oh, little G. Ah. And then he came he with his daddy and then he decided to stay for two years yeah. as well. So. Oh, and then in red and sort of cream as well. Is it so? I don't know if it's an actual red, is it? Or is it just like a pinky red? It's sort of a pinky salmon y sort of. What does it say? It just says red and white. So it sort of just, you know, fades between the two. Yeah, huh? Ooh. Ooh. Let's show it to the camera. It's oh, are, have they not seen it yet? Well, they have, actually, but there may be people on here that <laughs> haven't seen the last video. It's called Soft Chain Wool by Icicle. Yeah. And we've got two packs of each of it. I know I noticed there was... Yeah, two of each of them. Yeah, so that's put those over there. And then you've, is this from Kemp's? Yes. This Suki? Yes. I've got three colours of that. Oh, that's quite nice too, isn't it? People on the live video have seen this, but nobody on the online. Oh yeah, I thought it had a cottony feel to it. That's 30% cotton, that's yeah. nice that. I love it because it's got it's the got sequin. It's got little sequins in it too. Yeah. Can you see? It's got little... Tiny little sequins. It's called Sedo Suki. And there's... Purple, what other colour? <laughs> <laughs> it's sort of a very delicate shade though. That it one. is, it's all black. And it's got the silver, silver Lurex in that. This is from E. e Kemp's. Don't know whether they still got any left, but it was a bargain. So I had to get bargain. You know me, I'll do without my yeah, toast and jam. Yeah, because I know it's 50 grams, but it's... 120 yards. Yeah. So. I'll do with that my toast, but uh, my jam on my toast. It is a bargain. And like a sort of goldy colour. I love the that. Sequ yeah, the sequins are dead easy to see in that one, aren't Yeah, they? I love that colour. I don't think that's oh. going anywhere but to me. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. I think that's coming in my wardrobe. This is nice, that. But you can really see the sequins in that. Yeah, pretty. Pretty. It's lovely. Bobby Serda, I, you know, I love a brand. Yeah. And if you can get a brand for a cheap price, well, you know, you yeah. have to snaffle it, don't you? Well, you do it to be rude not to. Rude to leave it there. Yeah. Yes, absolutely rude to leave it there. Oh, what else? 
Well, um, flipping it. Where else have been? Oh, we've got some. This cotton. is ice as well. Uh, I may have showed you this before, but I may not. I don't remember. It's oh, for our. Shit. I love that colour. Yeah, it's gorgeous. for our new baby to be. Oh yeah, those together. Yeah, lovely. It's for it's ice. Is it cotton? Is it pure? Or is it bamboo? I can't remember what I bought. Organic baby cotton. Yeah. I think I got four shades. All oh, right, another one. No, there's another blue. Oh yeah, that's sort of a grey blue, isn't it? Yeah, but it is a very pale mm. blue. It's definitely yeah. blue. I was picking new, well, not new for colours because we know he's a boy, but I didn't want anything subtle. Subtle. And yeah. they love jeans, both of them. Uh, right. Him and my, my granddaughter and her husband both love jeans. Right. So that's why I got the denim. Yeah. Oh, yeah. very nice. I thought that would be nice for baby. And then I did get this for baby, although it's different. It's uh, a cotton. Is that a cotton? I think so. Let's have a look. Baby cotton, lemon yellow. That looks nice too. It's tightly packed, so I'm not undoing the pack. <laughs> It'll be get wrecked eventually. So I, don't I know, but that's eventually. <laughs> oh. Ooh. It's like Christmas and not even mine. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh my god, yeah, look at these. Now that was, that was lollies. That is amazing. I wanted the colour as near to the, you know the shawl yeah. I made? Look at that. But they didn't have the one with the yellows in. I have written, if you're watching Lolly, can you answer my query? Are you going to get any more of the other one in? The one I made the shawl in. Oh wow, that's yeah. lovely that. But that was that some, is really nice. Sure. That was the nearest one I could get to yeah. to the shawl I made with the yellow and purple in it. Yeah, they both they're both the same those two. I got three colours. I know because sometimes you look at it on the web page and you think, you know, it's this colour thing, isn't it? Yeah, it's the way it think, comes does over. It, it doesn't come over right, does it? Sometimes no, but. Now that's got the yellow and the orange in and the yeah. purple. But it's not but the it's same not the yellow, same. is it? No. Still very nice. Although I do like that orange and purple. <laughs> it's serious, that. Yeah. So I've got four of them and I thought you would like that one. Yeah, actually I do. That's very autumnal. It's very, yeah. That's, yeah. Uh, another one I've got four of those, I think. Is it three or four? Uh, three. Three, yeah. Oh, that's nice too. I like to make big shawls with when I get around. Yeah. I've got to do our baby things first. Yeah. Got to get the old knitting needles clicking. I've got to find the pattern. I'm on, I'm, I'm on with the black, white and grey. Yeah. Simon, is it? Yeah. yeah. So, Scott. Scott. Yeah. Um, I'm just near enough ready to start doing a border on it, so I haven't forgotten you. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Um, what else have we got? Oh, the last one some... is the uh, wool warehouse. Yeah. We're having oh, a drops. sale of drops. Now I've now, had drops cotton light and I haven't liked it. Yeah. Because it's split. I think you yeah, finished but this, up with some of it. Yeah, yeah. this muscat looks di oh, look I said that. it was called mus muskrat. <laughs> oh, that's nice. It feels a lot firmer, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. That light was loosely twisted and I couldn't yeah. approach you with it. I'm afraid drops oh, light is one of mine here. Yeah. Got oh, grey yeah. and white. Yeah. Oh, that's a lovely combination. Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous combination that. It was on sale at Wool Warehouse, I can't remember how much for, but it was quite reduced, about 89p or something like that. Something. Oh well, that's not bad is no, it? that was quite a bargain. Because there's over 100 yards on it, so... Yeah, and you get a free bag. <laughs> you do, I like these bags. And you get a free organdy bag. Yeah. Yeah, I love them, I keep all my stuff in them. Yay! Lovely! So that's what well, I, I do. Got. I do love, you know, even if it's not yeah. mine, I do mm. love squishing well, yarn. I know. One I've extra it. that I got also from Wool Warehouse. I looked at these, I was telling Jan mm. a few minutes ago. I said, I looked and I thought, oh yes, oh yes. But I didn't know what colour to get. I know, I was toying. I just did not know what colour to get. That's but they're good. fantastic, aren't they? And it's that, that red heart. Yeah. 
Well, that seems softer than your average red heart. They are soft. Super safe. They are soft. Really tough. A lot to fit the red heart. Brown with that red heart super saver. Yeah, can't beat it, can you? Wow, look at the colours in that. I forgot which one I got. There was a few when I was like, "Any, any, mine, mine." Which one shall I get? Because they were all so nice. Wow, that's another one that stayed with me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, which you know one's it's got this two. called? Favorite stripe. There's quite a few. It was neon stripe and all the yeah. different ones, and I just like that one. Wow. I think I saw this colour on DIY Seven Creations. Yeah. She picked some really nice jazzy colours and I thought, hmm, I like that colour. That's got to Do be you know, mine. looking at it, and it, it, there's not too much pink in it. Yeah. Because I think I looked and I thought, I wanted something that was sort of mm. jazzy but gender, gender neutral. Gender neutral, yeah, when you're making things for yeah. pram blankets and that. You really, unless you're going out and out pink or out and out blue, you're yeah. better off staying. Well, that's why gender, gender neutral. Yeah. Ours is getting orange. <laughs> I know it sounds awful, that. But, but you haven't told them the news. Oh, have I not? You've never told them the oh, news. Oh, no, I'm going to be grandma again. <laughs> I've been keeping it quiet because it was soon to news. No, I'm going to be grandma again in October. Yeah. And she went for a scan a few weeks ago. And we thought, I hope we're going to get to know. Because she wanted to know. But apparently all they got were photographs of its spine. It wasn't playing. She said the radiographer had a turning on one side, turning on another, mm. trying to, in, you know, in an effort to get baby to move. But, but no, the baby was staying put, and they've got lovely pictures of its spine. Well, at least you know it's all right. With yeah. The spine. You don't so know I'm, I'm no, so I'm no wiser. When's the next time? I'm not so. Quite a long time, isn't it? Um, you know, well, I think she could have had another scan. Yeah, I think we could have got You've got to do two, don't yeah. you? Usually, yeah. But uh, no, it's going to be a surprise. Mm. You know, like when I were having mine, we yeah. didn't, we didn't, we didn't have, know. No, we didn't know. I had a feeling mine was a boy, but you know, I could have been wrong. But I tell you what, I would have been so disappointed if it had been a girl. <laughs> I suppose I would have got over it. But. Yeah. Are you getting well, cosy, Gigi? Two granddaughters and a grandson, so... Could be either. either way, I'm happy. As long Could as it's alright and it's healthy. That's the main thing, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. But... Uh, when they arrive and you count with fingers and toes. And yeah. No, but that is... You know, you, you could say that was gender neutral, couldn't you? And do something yeah, really... Yeah. I think oh, dear. I think that's going to be... Uh, <coughs> you know, those great big... Maybe do that Doris... Chan one, you know that jackety thing that you did. What's it called? That loose baggy jacket. Oh, um I've no clue. <laughs> we managed to get the pattern after a lot of struggling, didn't we? Oh I know what you mean. The um uh, Indian Springs that's cocoon. The one. I might yeah. make that out. Yeah. I've made this complete one that's like a square. Stole, sold it up. Yeah. But I thought I might do... Oh, no, it's been nice, though. In the Indian Springs cocoon, yeah. In that Oh, one. no, that's nice. I can feel the card in my purse. It's going like that. <laughs> and it's not even in the same room as me. What, even after It's trembling. Holidays? Even after your holidays. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's be honest. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's lovely, that. Flipping egg. But these are nice too. Yeah. We are still going to go to Lolly's one day, but we haven't yeah. decided when. It's been too hot. And also you see, because even that's orange yeah. and purple, it's got a big pink in it, so it's sort of like... It's not that pink if it's no, the though, is it? No. Mm. We'll have I to go. That. We'll have to go and see when yeah. we get there. We've been, see, Sue's been away and different things have happened. And well, that's it. Yeah, hot. I started decorating. And you know what it's like when you start yeah. decorating. One job leads to another job. That it leads to another job. Been too and hot some, Yeah, and something else trips. needs sorting out. Mm. So we've sorted it out. and But it hasn't been too hot for car trips. 
It has been a bit warm, yeah. yeah. But it were nice, did it were nice uh, up at Woolfest. Oh yeah, but that wasn't too hot, hot was it? No, that no. was lovely that. Oh, really yeah. enjoyed myself. Mm. And it was lovely to see Claire and Zoe. Yeah. It was... Um, and that lady who tapped me on the shoulder and I still don't know your name. <laughs> I've forgotten it. You must write in the comments. You were wearing a yellow waistcoat, if that's any help. <laughs> and you said you do watch me on here, so I'm hoping that you will say, yes, it was me. Yeah. Please do. You did tell me your name and you did tell me what your group what her I name know, but was. come on. Well, we, um, were in a, we were in a, a shed full of wool. We were in a... a, a, a what do you call it? Like a zone, a haze, or whatever. That's you it. You get, it. Yeah, that's it. You get in the wool zone, don't yeah, you? Yeah, you get in the <laughs> Yeah. But it was a lovely day out, and it was lovely to meet people mm. from so far away. Yeah. It was absolutely a brilliant day out. And we did see so many beautiful things. We, oh. We didn't really buy anything. I bought two shawl pins, didn't I? But that's... I don't think I bought anything, but I was just sort of like so... You saw a lot of things though, didn't you? So inspirational. I yeah. saw a lot of things that half of them I've forgotten now. But just, yeah, you know, so interesting. Those, those Manx ladies oh, from the yeah, Isle of yeah. Man with the weaving. Yeah. Um, they had um, sort of like a peg loom, I think yeah. it was called. And that was, I was fascinated by it. Yeah, I was sitting down at the time. <laughs> I was absolutely fascinated by it. And I went back, didn't I? Yeah. Just to have another look and yeah. see some of the other things. I balanced my chair well when I sat down this that time. Lucky yes, yeah. But uh, no, it was a brilliant day. Yeah. Like I say, so inspirational, you know, and, and to see other people with the same mindset yeah yeah i was fascinated with the people walking around they were all wearing such gorgeous things they were they? yeah and obviously they'd made them themselves and yeah. but they look fantastic i was following a lady around because she was wearing like a drop knitted cardigan yeah in, in like a gray color it was yeah but i was i was literally following it around trying to, trying to weigh she, it up trying to weigh it up how she made it you know <laughs> So if you, sorry lady, if you're watching me, I wasn't staring at you really, I was looking, staring at you. Yeah. But there was so much, wasn't there? Mm. You know, and you'd mm. see one person, the next person behind them would have something. And I would have loved to have commented to, you know, some I, of the people. I did to I some like, people. Yeah. I said, I really like your jacket. And, you know, like they were, oh, thank you. you yeah. Know? And um, I thought I must do that more often. Yeah. You know? <laughs> You're not being creepy. I wasn't like saying, have you got the pattern or anything like that, which Mind people you, do. Mind you, after saying that, uh, well, it's a couple of years ago now, I'd gone, uh, I think I'd gone to Asda, and I saw this woman wearing like a winter granny jet, coat, yeah. and I thought, wow, and I got out of my car and I looked across the car park and she disappeared, and I thought, where's she gone? <laughs> and then I spotted her. On the corner, on the corner of like Asda, where yeah. and home bargains, where Abacan is. Yeah. I thought if she's going in Abacan, yeah. I've just got to go and. <laughs> Stop. Anyway, I did. I went in, mm. and as I got closer, I thought, "What a piece of work!" You mm. know what I mean? And I meant that in a nice way, not a piece of work as in. As a horrible, yeah. I thought that is fantastic, mm. and actually had a conversation with her about it, and she was so chuffed. Yeah. I think you are when people yeah. actually stop you in the street. But it was fantastic. She had made a fantastic coat. Yeah. You don't like your granny takes a yeah. trip, but it was a proper winter coat. Yeah. But some people have a flair with colour. Yeah. I yeah. I really don't have that flair with colour. I put together colours that I like, but I don't yeah. have that edge. Yeah, some people do and some people don't, you know. And yeah. I think the harder you try, the, yeah. the more elusive it is, because so, I know... Yeah, I accidentally made a shawl once that had edge. Yeah. And it was all oddments I'd used, but they were all shades of blues and greys. That and shawl is gorgeous. And that just had edge with yeah. it. Yeah. I've, I've tried to sort of replicate it in different colours since then. I know, but it, it either works or it, it doesn't, doesn't, you know. It doesn't kind of uh, work the same. I just wish I had this... I mean, I've even bought the books, you know, on colour combinations, you know, from... Um, My trouble um, is I'll get, and I, I always like doing it 
stuff with an odd number of colours. Yeah. Don't know why it's got to be an odd number of colours for me. Yeah. But I'll get five colours and think, well, that one's not right. Yeah. You know, and you swap it out for something else, and then that one's not right. And it's like, just do it. Yeah. Susan, just get on with it. Yeah. Because nine times out of ten, if I'm overthinking it. Yeah. I do that. I try so hard to be too picky, I think. Yeah. Whereas I think if you just go, right, don't, 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 that's it. Now. Yeah. You know, I mean, there's some people on uh, Pinterest and on uh, Facebook and that. They've just when you just got, look and think, oh, man. How they got those colours yeah. together? They're so fantastic. And they weren't colours I would have chosen. No. To go together. And yet they do go together. And... You can either do subtle, can't you? Or yeah. Or bold. Yeah. And it makes a completely different garment. It does. You know. It does. You, I mean, I only wear bright colours, as you know, but it doesn't stop me from admiring the. Yeah. Um, you know, people who choose something that's just all shades yeah. of subtle, and I think, oh, that's so lovely. Why didn't I think? Of that? Yeah. <laughs> this is why I wanted the help of that design student, but that was a miserable failure. Uh, one lady said she would help me, and then she never replied. And then another lady said, oh, yeah, I'll chat fashion with you. And she's never replied. And I'm thinking, why did they say they would do it? And then they don't, you Yeah. Know? So, oh, it's so angry. It makes me so angry. I wish they wouldn't answer. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, if they but don't what, answer me, I think... I'm sorry, I'm just yeah, all distracted. On. Get distracted, I don't and know. And oh, they're lovely. And like you say, that one... It's so me as well, yeah. isn't it? Well, I, you know, well, I got that. Like, it looked a bit brighter on the pages, and when it came, I thought, ooh, that's nice. No, that's nice. That's, I thought, that is yeah. a Sue colour, that one. But I'm just drawn to that purple and... Orange, yeah. Yeah, because that bright... Yeah. This is the one I keep... Lolly, if you're watching, will you answer me? Call. I keep sending yeah. her emails saying, that. have you got any more of this, or will you be getting Look any it. more of it's it? It's just gorgeous. But she... She hasn't answered me. See, just look. Yeah. So just if you pop in lollies, will you say? Jan's been trying to get hold of you. Yeah. <laughs> she wants to know. Well, you're busy ladies, me. but come on. This is just, yeah. you know, yeah. isn't it? Come, come on. on. If we get there, I'm going to take this with me and say, look. Yeah. I even sent her a picture. And I said, this is what I've been making with your wool. And, um. God, it's lovely, isn't it? I love it. Yeah, the colours are just. Yeah. The blue Man, one. these are nice. But that yellow just seems to yeah. sing out, doesn't it? Yeah. See, that one, the only... Well, I don't know if they only had two, but I only got two of those. Um, so, I think it's a bit finer, though, isn't it? So It does look finer. So it probably will make us bigger. Yeah. Because sure. this is... Yeah, this is that's more... That's yeah. Yeah. And that's, I think, it's double knit, isn't it? Yeah, because it doesn't have the yardage on it. But it's 200 grams, nearly, so... Yeah, so there should be enough to make a shower yeah. with two of them. See, these are oh, much gosh, yeah. These are much thicker. These are. Um, they yeah. don't say they're iron, but it is iron, isn't it? Yeah. Is this one a thick one or a thin one? Thick well, that's a thick one, isn't it? Yeah, that's an iron. It's just that's that other one that's that small. Oh dear. We have to have a trip to. Oh, oh, oh I'll just take my lip in it. <sighs> it's healing up, folks. It's healing up. That's why I've not been making any videos because I had a lip that looked like I'd been in a fight, and it was only the dentist I can assure you. Always lovely. Mm. Even though it's yeah. hot, you just want to go. Oh. Yeah, I went to the dentist and uh, had all my lips numbed. And when I was leaving, she said, "Be careful that you don't bite the lip." So what did you do? You bit your lip? No, I didn't bite it. I chewed it. Oh. And I had this ulcer that oh, it was all swollen all across here, and I had an ulcer that was that long. Oh gosh. Anyway, it's the ulcer's kind of gone now, but it's left raw pink skin underneath it and it's still a bit swollen but oh i couldn't make a video i just look like i what she calls uh, sylvester Stallone's mother you know <laughs> when she had that lip that fake lip job I, I just looked like i'd had fake lip filler oh, on one no. side oh it was awful i felt really self-conscious yeah i went on the live video but i didn't i didn't make one of these i couldn't i just couldn't i was trying to get rid of it yeah, I might get rid of that other blue and turquoise, uh, turquoise and purple one. Although I have got another one. The bottle. turquoise and purple one. It's hanging up around the corner there. I, I made it at the same time as yeah. that. Yeah. 
Although I do have enough yarn to make another one of that turquoise and purple anyway. But that is it's just lovely, isn't it? Yeah, I decided I really only really yeah. need one shawl. But I was making the two just in case no, whichever one. Sort of like I, I need all my shawls. <laughs> which whichever one but now I the need, best. Yeah, I need to make some to sell. Yeah. Need to get some more of that. Yeah. There's some more upstairs anyway. Not that not that colour though. <laughs> no, I know, but it's just that colour is just amazing. Amazing, yeah. Absolutely. That is amazing. just me and it's amazing. And yeah. I'll not get rid of that one. I'm sorry, but I'm not gonna buy that one at all. Yeah, you can look at it now. Yeah. I'll flung it over. That fat thing that we need to sort out. Yeah. She's supposed to be a plus size model. Yeah, and but we've not got round to And we got doing we started the off finer parts. very enthusiastically, then yeah. we sort of fizzled out. Yeah. You know? But hey ho. We will unfizzle. Yeah. The things I've been making lately have fitted on. That's the I know um, it's lovely that. The Gulf Coast shrug, it's yeah. the free pattern on Ravelry. That's that cotton from Lolly's. It's worked up a lot nicer. It, it has, felt, yeah. It felt a little bit stiffer and rougher in... in Molly's is going to have to have a visit. She's going to have to have a visit. Yeah. Look at this baby. Definitely going to have to have a visit. I have missed my little baby so much. <laughs> <laughs> but it's been so hot we couldn't cuddle. He came a couple of days and he just was absolutely fed up. He was fed up. Mind you, the heat's been... Oh, hot. Hot has been the word, yeah. But we had rain last night, so at least my garden. Yeah, we've got puddles and my uh, tarpaulin that's over my sun chairs. I'm glad I left them over <laughs> the tarpaulin. Oh, I kept yeah. saying the other night, I was talking to my friend on, on Google, as we do, my American friends, and I kept saying, it feels like rain, it feels like rain. It's not like rain for days. And it had rained overnight, it yeah. did rain overnight, yeah. But uh, no, my garden I've usually got a swamp at the bottom yeah. and it's dried out that much yeah. that all the, you know, water loving plants all are, are, are all looking very sorry for themselves. Yeah, I've lost my fern, haven't I? Yeah, well I've had to cut two ferns back, I had two beautiful massive ferns that have been the, uh, in my front garden actually yeah. um, for a good few years. And it's the first time that it's been bone dry. And they just flopped. Yeah. But the trouble was they flopped on the hostas. Yeah. So they flopped over. But the stems had sort of broken at yeah. the bottom. So I thought, no, just... Well, I even had to look if you could find my ferns. Yeah. They're not even there. No, I just cut everything off and I thought, there's still chance that, yeah. you know, you might get some new fronds. Yeah, unless the gardener cut them off because they died. She came the other week. She might have just might have done, yeah. You know, they were all yeah. dead and everything. But my gunner is all right. Yeah. So, and that likes water. Would have been all right with cactus, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> For one year only. <laughs> a cactus? Yeah. I can remember I kept a cactus, when I was a kid, kept a cactus. For absolutely ages and ages. And one year it flowered. Beautiful pink flower. I mean, yeah. And it died. Oh, dear. And I kept it all those years. Yeah. It was neglected on the kitchen window bottom. Mind you, I think, cat, you know, yeah. cacti are, aren't they? Yeah. You know, you sort of water them, ooh, when you remember. Yeah, when they look yeah. dried up. And, yeah. But I don't know what happened to it. It must have just come to the end of its life. Yeah. Because yeah. I've had it years. Or you just abused it that once too often. Yeah, I'd had it years and years. And then it flowered, beautiful pink flower it was. Yeah. Only flower it ever had. <laughs> and then it died. <laughs> he was trying to tell me something. Yeah. Right. Look I'm, at me, I'm here. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I've always wanted to know, but I never would look after it, would be a bonsai tree. Right. You know. I wouldn't know where to start. No, it's you've got fine. to be. Oh, I'd be frightened to death. You've got to clip them back and treat them like this yeah. and that. Oh, they're too complex for me. Oh, I'm proper retro. Uh, spider plants. Love oh. spider plants. I killed my last spider plant and I'd had it. Or its mother. Because, you know, you can yeah. yeah. I'd had that since long before I was married. The original one used to live in the bathroom. And we were talking before yeah. about macrame. Yeah. 
hanging things. They, they're all back in, aren't they? Yeah, really? I love them. Well, I had a spider plant. I used to, when we first moved here, I had an, an old fashioned toilet that had the system up high on the wall. Yeah. And it had brackets. Yeah. So I used to hang this macrame thing thing with it had big wooden beads on it. It was yeah. really, you know, 60s. I must admit, I have made one. Mm. It's not, by any means, it's not perfect. And I made it in the wrong sort of stuff. But I made it and it mm. looks. It looks all right. Yeah, mine was. But I'd love to make a, a proper one. Yeah, big wooden rings that were halfway down, like yeah. on the strands, and then it had these massive big beads, big wooden beads yeah. on it. I mean, I bought it obviously. I didn't make it, but I got yeah. it in one of these crafty shops. You yeah, know, like... I had one given to me. Oh, I'm talking many, many yeah. moons ago, and it's a double one. Mm. Yeah, you know, you put one and then one, and one. Then, yeah. then another. That's what mine was. Yeah. But it's in the garage and I won't chuck it out. Mm. And I'm just wondering if I could wash it. Mine went, it just perished in the end. I wonder if I could wash mine. You know, the twine or whatever I'll they'd used. The twine they'd yeah. used just perished. We well, see, I only use sort of like, I think it was like garden stuff for this one that I've made. Yeah. But it, it came out all right. Yeah. Maybe well, I'd should. like to learn how to make the ones that go flat against the wall. They're like a wall hanging, but then oh, they yeah. come round and you put your... Yeah. You I'm sure there, in. Must, there must be some. Yeah. If you know any YouTube videos on how to make a... F the flat wall. The flat one that goes against the yeah. wall. Yeah. Let us know. Um, I've never really done the crown. I think I tried once with a belt because, if I remember rightly, it was so fashionable in the 60s. Yeah. Well... A long, long time ago, junior school, and I, I remember the name of them. They were called art straws, and they were paper straws, but they must have been mm. about that long. Yeah. And you know, you you bought yeah a good amount of them, and we used to sort of twist them round bottles, yeah, macrame style, yeah, and all sorts of different things. Yeah. But they were amazing. They were. I remember at school doing a raffia lampshade, you remember them? You bought yeah. the lampshade frame. Yeah. And then you got this raffia and you you bent it round and took it across. I'm so proud of this. We put it up in the lounge and we couldn't see a thing because it was all like spider's webs all around oh, everywhere where the light came through. And my mother kept saying, It's very, very pretty, she says, and I appreciate all your hard work but I can't see what I'm doing. Yeah. <laughs> because in those days we, we didn't have standard lamps and stuff yeah. like that. We just had the one big light in the middle. It's a big light, so Yeah, I mean, <laughs> my mother couldn't see That's knitting. That's the Lancashire thing. She couldn't see her knitting because I'd chosen one of those real 60s things that went round like that. Yeah. You know, so there was only a hole at the bottom like that. And all you got was this, it was very pretty. It's like a spider's web design all around the room. <laughs> I don't know what ever happened to that. Probably threw it away. But it'd take me ages to do because you have to make sure that the raffia's flat. Right, yeah. And not like all twisted and yeah. stuff, yeah. Oh, I thought I was really clever making that. Yeah. Oh, no, I like, I must admit, I do like my crown, mm. eh? And raffia um, handbags, whatever happened to them? They probably perished. Yeah, crochet raffia handbags. They were all the rage yeah. when I was young. When I was in my teens. Yeah. That's many, many moons ago before a lot of you were born. Uh, yeah, they yeah. were all lined with flowers and everything. Wolfest, they had some lovely baskets, oh, didn't God, they? Those baskets. Oh. They were fantastic. They were. But as usual, you know, I had no pennies. But they, they were very I know, pretty. but the thing is, it's mm. sort of like, I thought, oh, I've got one of them, similar. Mm. And I bought mine in Germany yeah. about 10 years ago. And I think I only paid. It must have been about, five, I'm yeah. sure it was five or six years. They were beautiful. Euros. They were all different colours, weren't they? Yeah. They were Mine's just baskets. sort of like natural colour mm. and navy blue. Yeah. But it's there now. It's got, it got me crochet in it. I know what I was going to do. Find that thing with wheels on. Yes. Bring it out of its hiding place. Yeah. I found it, would you believe, on top of somebody's dumpster. And it had off, obviously been a baby gift. Yeah. It was covered in pink ribbons. And it was so beautiful, it was just stood there and it was brand new, you could see it. Yeah. You? A little basket with wheels on and I thought, ooh, going shopping, I thought if that's still there when I come back, I'm having it. 
Anyway, I brought it back and took all the pink ribbon off it. And, uh, it was supposed to be my yarn. But it got... Hey, but you used it for a while and it looked really nice. Yeah, but then it got powdered in the... Oh. Yeah. I need to sort it out because under. it's got all my project bags in that I don't really use. I need to find another place. Yeah. For my project bags, that's what I need. I need to have a good sort. We can sit, we can do that. Yeah, I don't use project bags much. No, they seem like a very good idea. But my problem is, I can't see exactly instantly what's in, what's in them. And these days I haven't got the memory to think, oh, that's the blue project bag, it's got yeah. such a thing in it. Mm. That's the orange project bag, it's got another such a thing in it. And Unless I'm going to the hospital, I used to have my hospital project bag that always had a virus shot with it. But I've not been going to the hospital lately. Yeah. So there's nothing in me. Uh, my hospital yeah. project bag, nothing in it. It was just there with the pattern and the hook and the... Yeah. Um, I could just pick it up and take it with me. I didn't have to think. That was the only one. But now I've got one half finished thing that's in a project bag. And because it's in the project bag and I can't see it. Yeah. It's just... I'm going to have to take it out because it's never going to get finished in that project bag. I don't know how you all keep track of them. No. You know, you've got stocks in this one. I, I do one, maybe. I can't do that. I was going to do it that way. Two things at the most. And because um, I'm not being rude, I'm doing peace. Um, there was two things, really, mostly. I, I know you have lots of projects, but I can't. Yeah. It's how you can function. Some people yeah. function. With lots and lots and lots of projects, don't they? Yeah. I don't. I have to do one thing really, from start to finish, unless I get something that gets like the baby knitting. I will do something else as well as that, because I can't sit and knit for hours and hours no, on end no. because it'll set my shoulders off. So I must confess, when I start the baby's knitting, I'll be doing some crochet yeah. in between. So I will be doing two projects, but they won't be going in project bags. <laughs> And I've got some lovely project bags, it's a shame. Yeah. I bought them all, like you do, the trend. Oh, everybody's got a project bag. I must get some project bags. And then no, just, they don't work for me, personally. They don't work for me, either. They're all sitting there. Beautiful project Unless bags. Unless they're like that. Oh, yeah, you can see through them. And you can see what's in them. I must admit, those will wear ice bags are fantastic. Yeah. And you can probably buy them. Oh, you can, yeah. You can get everything on eBay if you Yeah. Look. You know me, great eBay. If I don't look on eBay each day, I get frustrated. <laughs> Do you know, I've been really good and yeah. I haven't had my computer on for about four days now. Yeah. Because I think sometimes you get a little bit, I've got to, I've got to, I've yeah, got to. Yeah, I'm a bit that way. Why? And it's dawning but, on me, it's not the end of the world if you don't look at your computer. But how I'm coping with it now is... I put things in my watch list. Right. Don't put them in my basket. Don't do that. I put them in my watch list. And then I'll go back the day after or the day after that and look. And then I think, oh, I put that in there for. Don't want that. So knock it out the watch list. Knock it off the watch list. And then if I'm looking at something to wear, again, the same thing. I put it in the watch list. And then I watch how the price climbs. Yeah. And then if it gets to a certain price, I think out of my price yeah. range now, so I delete that. Don't look at it again. Yeah. Um, I'd, I'm not entered in bidding wars with anybody. No. Because it's just stupid. I know what I want to pay for a certain thing. Yeah. And that includes the postage. If I think a dress is worth, say, £10 with the postage. Yeah, that's all you... That's all I want to pay. Yeah. yeah. And I just won't go silly anymore. Um, no. It's so easy to do, though, isn't it? That's how I got in a mess yeah. in the first place. I know, with but my, it's just um, so easy to With do. my machine codes. Yeah. That's how I got in a mess with machine codes. Because I was bye, bye, bye. Yeah. I was going crazy. I've got more machine codes than I could throw. A... <sighs> yeah. yeah, but the what you mean. Is, we've got to get the machine going. Oh, we got, right, we got yeah. inspired, didn't we, when we were yes. in... Um, yeah, uh, when we were at Wolf Fest, we so we say no until something's produced. Beautiful, beautiful, fine lacy shawls. Yeah. Beautiful. But as oh, we there were some doors that were really, really ethereal. Oh, you could see oh. right through them. They were absolutely gorgeous. Gossamer, they were just, oh, And they had beads around the edge, yeah. didn't they? And they had felt 
little felt leaves yeah. around the edge. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, God, dear. I've never had it. It would take me a million years to have it one of them. Gorgeous. You just have to sit solid for weeks to make one of them, wouldn't you? Do you know what? I wish I'd have taken a, a, a name and what have you because I, I would have. Yeah. I would have said because she was reasonably priced as well. Yeah. That lady who was selling those at thirty pounds, they were gorgeous. Oh, it's like <gasps> they were oh, madam, beautiful. You know. Thirty pounds. It was nothing for. I know. The for work the, yeah, the, done in the, the look. Yeah. I should have took more photos, I was just too busy yeah. going, hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Zoe took some more photographs, and I think Claire took more photographs, but none of them were of the... Yeah, because each of us, we all yeah. like different things, don't we? Yeah. And some of the buttons, oh, oh, oh. Yeah. But they were like £10 for four buttons, you know, and I thought, hmm. If you're making something for yourself that's good to be a statement, fair do, fine, fair do. but... But like for something like these, yeah. I can't pay. No. I mean, I can't pay even like a You can't put sort of like, oh, this is 60 quid because a tenner of that's the button. No, exactly. You can wash that. No. <laughs> no. People no, no, don't no. see. Uh... And if you like this, let me know because this is going on Etsy. I've just been too lazy to I put know, it on there. I know, it's lovely. And that's that Lolly's cotton that I said felt you, you rough. Thought, yeah. And it's been a it's dream to crochet up. It's lovely. Yeah. So I take it back, Lolly, I, about your cotton. I take it all back. Because it did feel a little bit harsh in the ball, but made up, it's made up lovely. And we ought to know better because we've bought stuff. Mm. Got it and thought, oh, been a bit disappointed. But yeah. when you've started to work with it, it's been lovely. You've yeah. thought, hey, oh, this is all right. So apart from the white that had the glitter in that was like rough, that I got from Yeah, Lolly. that was a dead failure. That was a dead failure. Apart from that, everything I've got from it has been wonderful. Yeah. Too. Well, I've always been pleased with stuff I've got. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to make scrub it or something. <laughs> <laughs> Exfoliated cloths with yeah. it. Yeah. You know. I keep telling Sue to take one home and she keeps leaving it here. Don't worry, she's trying to win. She doesn't want it. <laughs> <laughs> she's too polite to yes, tell me. Far too polite. Far too polite to tell me. I'm a lady. <laughs> Stick your white light. Stick your white lure because I don't want to make a scrubby. <laughs> Jan, to be perfectly honest, I'm sure I could provide some white lure in, in, in my own stash. Yeah. Oh dear. I've had some failures with buying things, but it's just rough and smooth. Well, isn't it? do you take you do take the rough with the smooth, don't yeah, you? You yeah. know. My we buy off, failures. We buy off internet yeah and what do we expect my failures have been a lot less though than my successes yeah you know i've mostly been very happy with yeah. things i've bought off the internet uh especially since lot i don't know who told me about lollies was it you no no i don't know who told me about lollies but thank you very much yeah. whoever did because <laughs> you told me because i think i had to ask you about three times what's it called again lollies little wool shock it doesn't exactly roll off the tongue does it yeah, but once you know it, it does, but... <laughs> it's like random, random, these rambling, whatever she's called. Yeah. <laughs> and Cozy Cottage Corner. Is she called Crochet Cozy Cottage Corner or something? All these alliterations. She'd yeah. rather too much for my brain. Yeah. I know, it's just catching up with everything and yeah. finding the time to watch everything mm. and craft. I must admit. Since I found out I could put YouTube on my telly, I've been on yeah. the better because I can watch things on the telly because I have not been watching football. So please don't ask me anything to do with football. No, I haven't. I must no. have I know it's very sad we didn't get to the final, but so it's one of them things, isn't it? I watched the odd match, but because I hadn't watched any England matches yeah. up until the other night, yeah. I thought, out of principle, I, th I can't watch it because I'll jinx them, but... It didn't matter because yeah, I didn't we didn't get any. through. But no, Tour de France is on at the moment. Oh, is it? Yeah. I like watching oh, Wimbledon. that. Oh, no, Tour de France because it's like, they go obviously through France. Yeah. But there are some parts and they're like, I've been there. Yeah. I've been near there. I suppose you don't watch <coughs> John Glenn, the Beardy Shield. Not because he's a knitter, because I know you don't watch knitting, but he shows you around parts of Scotland when he's doing it, you know, sometimes. I have watched a couple of them, yeah, the couple of them but yeah. I just, 
at the moment. I'm too damn busy. I know. I do, well, in theory, I have loads of time, in theory. Oh, theory. But what tell do I, about what, it. I have a home all day. What do I do with my time? Yeah, I no. don't know. I can't tell you. I've got dishes in the sink, won't wash it. I've got a hoover parked in the middle of the lounge, because <laughs> I've hoovered half. Uh, that's my half, half a job. Yeah. <laughs> But now, of course, I've got my little friend here, so, you know. Oh, well, you've got to have an afternoon with your friend, don't Oh, you? yeah, I've not seen him for a and while. You can't, so. It's pointless hoovering up until he's gone. Yeah, oh, yeah, it's an excuse. It's yeah. It. We can think of an excuse for everyone. It's not an excuse, it's practicality. Yeah, because I've missed my little baby so much. Because the last few times he's been, he's been too hot. Yeah. To be um, sitting on your knee, he's not wanted to. Yeah. So I know he's himself, I was getting a bit of a complex, you know, thinking what have I done? <laughs> Why does my dog want to escape? No, know? it's just a dog. When he escaped the and other week. He does what dogs do. Yeah, I told you that, didn't he? He escaped. No. The gardener came and I thought he was going to see Hazel. Yeah? Straight past her, straight past Tony. None of them could grab him. Straight down Sunny Drive like he did before. The bloke up the road tried to stop him. He was in his Jeep thing, tried to stop him more. So I gets my little scooter out, zooms off down this way, because I knew where he was going, he was going to the clough. So I gets down there, I said, have you seen a chihuahua? And the people who were walking the dog said, you mean Gigi? Yeah, he's gone that way. <laughs> oh, oh my God. So I'm on the phone to Richard, Richard, Gigi's disappeared. What, what, what? Anyway, I came right round again, went round Gardner Road to where he would come out at. And he, uh, he did, he was there with Richard. Oh gosh, who the heck's this? My phone. I'll answer it later. <laughs> yeah, if it's important, they'll leave a message or I could bring back one. It never is. It's always somebody trying to sell me yeah. something. Yeah. Nine times out of ten, yeah. Yeah. If my mobile rings after this, then I'll know it's somebody who knows. Yeah. Me. But apart from that, we'll just leave it, shall we? Yeah. It stopped. There you go. It stopped. But I bet our camera stopped on. I've heard it beep. No, well, I'll tell you what, we'll. Do I go buys? Yes. Then I'll take this upstairs for you if you want oh, to upstairs. Oh, yes, please, because I so, wobble when I go upstairs. Right, so, so, nice to be back. Yes. Nice to see you all without my big fat lip. <laughs> so we shall see you again. Yes. Soon, hopefully. Whenever Sue gets tired. Yeah. <laughs> You'll see me again. So much for this bloody retirement lad. I'm like the bad penny, you know me. I always turn off. So. <laughs> right. Right. Who's got better going off the Well, bits? I've got the baby. Oh, oh gosh, yeah, you have. Oh, uh, flipping heck. I've got the baby. You didn't show your cardigan. Oh, no, I didn't. I did make a cardigan, but I'll show you later because I'm waiting yeah. for the bottles to arrive. So, oh, well, it's full of Gigi hair now, so that's